So, um, some bolt inspection today. This is the sort of bolt um, that you get if you connect two large flanges together and then that's going either end. And the idea is to find a crack in the threads uh, before um, it gets to a critical size and even to find it when it's under a millimetre in depth, so it's still hiding in the threads. So what we've got is uh, this 16 element ultrasonic probe, phased array probe, connected to uh, this instrument here. And you can see um, the threads as we go down the bolt, uh, and you can see the, the defect uh, hiding in that thread there. I just grab the, the cursor, uh, put it on here. Now we can see the uh, A scan um, from this thread as well. So as we move the probe, around 180 degrees on the bolt that uh, defect disappears from one side on the screen and then as we come around the other side we pick it up on the other side here so it's the same defect but we've moved just 300 um, 180 degrees around the bolt so then when we're on that side we can get our cursor point at that defect and then we can see the a scan uh, from that angle as well okay so that's this bolt here is um, fairly small, or if it's a bigger bolt. Okay, so over here on the bench, we have this one meter long bolt, type of bolt that uh, holds wind turbines into the ground and all sorts of other structure. Uh, and we're gonna put some gel on the end of here. Pop our probe on. And then we're looking at the screen. So what we can see is, um, first off, these threads are a lot closer together than the other bolt but still we've got this um, this defect in here so we can grab our cursor point it there and we can see the signal from that slot so if we look uh, at this bolt I'll take the probe off what it is what that defect is here is uh, is a slot being cut in there into the thread so the thread is about a mil in depth and that slot is about two mil in depth so that would equate to a crack about a mil um, in depth and there it is it's really easy to see okay so that's the threaded part of the bolt here this is the threaded part but this bolt is a meter long so what about if we wanted to get further down to the bolt okay so back over to the instrument and go here and we just quickly change our range to a meter and now we're looking down the full length of the bolt so these indications here are from the bottom of the bolt and these indications are from a slot cut down at about 700 mil so if we look down the bolt again if we look at the bolt you can see that's that slot there. We've still got our little slot at the top. So I'll put the probe back on. So in one setup, we can see these uh, defects at 700 mil. We can see the bottom of the bolt. And it's a little hard to make out those defects. But if I just change the range again, back to, I don't know, 200 mil. And there we are. All I've done is change the range and we can find the defects. There at, what's that, 140 mil. And we change it again to 1,000. And we can still see just about that defect right at the front there. Defect at 700 mil and the back of the bolt all in one go. See, phased array isn't hard.